The nose landing gear doors can be opened on the ground for servicing or inspection purposes. Some precautions have to be taken before the doors are opened. Ground safeties and nose wheel chocks in place. Downlock safety pin in. In the cockpit, put warning notices on the freefall handle and on the landing gear control lever. Make sure that the green hydraulic system is depressurized. Outside again, make certain that the door travel ranges are clear. Stand aft of the gear leg. Disengage the safety pin. Press the button at the end of the handle. Rotate the handle to the open position. Doors open by gravity. Lock them with a safety pin. Caution. A safety pin must be fitted on each door immediately after it has been opened on the ground and before working in the nose gear well. Adjust the door position manually to ease the installation of the safety pin if necessary. After servicing, the doors can be closed. Here are some precautions that have to be taken. In the cockpit, Landing gear control lever down with the warning notice in position. Landing gear free fall crank handle in the normal position. Folded and a warning notice in position. Green hydraulic system depressurized. On the ground, make certain that the ground door opening control handle is locked in the open position. Remove the safety pin from the doors. Make certain that the door travel ranges are clear. In the cockpit, make sure that the external power is on. Pressurize the green hydraulic system. Check the pressure on the ECAM page. On the ground, reposition the ground door opening control handle in the closed position and put the safety pin back in position. In the cockpit, check that the doors are up and locked on the wheel ECAM page. Depressurize the hydraulic systems and remove the warning notices.